It's out. It's Williamson. Passed across. Gabby Kays. And it's good for the goal. Fired out to Liguri as we get down to midfield here. Stopped by her and fed forward by Kate Smith. Also Eastern Connecticut State, the defending Little East champs. Kat Mason backhand in there for the goal. And Amherst now on top by a score of two to nothing as Cat Mason picks up the score. Pass near side. Finds its way to Jackie DeLeva. Left side of the circle. Abby Kays fires it in. Finds DeLeva battling into the front. And she's able to get the point blank goal to make it three to nothing Amherst. And picked back up by the Mammoths. Mason up top. Pushed aside. Liguri. Right side of the circle, sends it across, nearly tapped in for the goal. Meanwhile, the backhand, the recovery, and it's back-to-back -back goals for Jackie DeLeva. Tobias again now trying to back in. Ball comes out, Mazambani puts it towards the goal, and it bounces in for the score. Muffy Mazambani is on the board for the Mammoths to make it 5 to nothing with 7.16 to go. Collected by Mason. Mason sends it forward. Got the stick of Tobias there. Tobias now back for DeLeva. Did she get the backhand or that one is knocked in for the own goal? They did credit it to DeLeva. So that will be a hat trick for her if that stands in the box score. So three goals for Jackie DeLeva, two goals for Muffy Mazambani, and a goal for Kat Mason in this one. That rounds out your scoring as Amherst comes up with a 6 to nothing shutout win over Keene State to move to 2-1 and one on the season. Keene State falling to 1-2. and two.